Hey, what is up guys? Matt here from the Toasty Barrels and I'm back with another PC flipping video. Today I'm going to be going over some of my favorite pre-built towers to look out for when hustling for some PC builds to clean up, upgrade, and flip for some profit. So, how about we get right into it, shall we? After a word from today's sponsor. As a creator, creating content is almost second nature. Once the idea hits my mind, I almost go into autopilot doing scripting, recording, and editing until it's complete. However, getting it seen on the crowded space that is YouTube is a whole other challenge. With TubeBuddy though, you get access to a wide range of tools like tag optimizers and search ranking results to help you optimize your content to succeed on YouTube. Want to give it a shot? Click the link down below to learn more. Now I'm going to be finding some examples of these builds on eBay today, but these builds can really be found pretty much anywhere that you can find secondhand PC hardware, or that's Gumtree, eBay, Facebook Marketplace, or wherever you may look. If you wish to get some of these deals on eBay though, check the link in the description down below. I have a couple examples listed down there. Now the first one, and the most common one, and easy to find, is the Dell Optiplex 790 and 990 towers. These are the time-tested i5-2400 and i7-2600 towers that you can pretty much find anywhere for a really good price. Now the 790 and 990 are full tower pre-builds, which are the ones you want to look for if you do not plan on doing a case swap. But if you do, I actually made a video just a few days ago, if you hit the on the top right corner, where I go over my favorite PC cases to use when flipping from a used PC tower to a new tower, kind of try to make it look more gamery. So if you're interested in that, hit the eye in the top right corner to check that video out. When looking for these PCs, I recommend anywhere between the price point of $100 to $150 and really focus on trying to secure as much RAM as you can. I've seen these towers go anywhere from four gigabytes all the way up to like 12 gigabytes. And most modern gaming towers, you really want at least six gigabytes, especially with these i5-2400s. But if you can get eight, that would be the best overall experience. The ideal system would be an i5-2400 PC, a 500 gigabyte hard drive, and eight gigs of RAM for $130 shipped. If you can get those, buy as many of them as you can because those are really easy to flip if you even try to transfer it into another case or just keep it as a pre-built on its own. All you really have to do is add a GPU, new power supply, and you probably spend about $200 to $250 for a PC that you could flip for $300 or above easily on the used market. Now another tower I recommend is the HP Z220 with i5-3570s. Now this one is a lot harder to find, but if you can actually find it, you will get a little bit more power compared to the Sandy Bridge CPU lineup, and you really can't go wrong with these systems. The only downside, as I mentioned, is their availability on eBay. As far as pricing goes, I would look around the same price point, $100 to $150, because you're really only getting slightly more performance compared to the i5-2400 counterparts, but going for newer hardware like a 3570 could mean a longer lifespan span for the end consumer. At max, I would only spend about $160 on one if you do end up finding an option that has like 8 or 12 gigs of RAM and maybe a high-end hard drive. Now, these are a few towers that I recommend, and thing is, they come in many different configurations, all the way from an i5-2400 all the way up to like newer i5s and i7s. On these really budget systems, as long as you're not spending over $200 on a base tower with an i5-2400 or greater, you should be in good shape with being able to flip the PC for a profit and after doing some upgrades. Now, I know I said the focus of this video is going to be on pre-built towers, but there is a new trend with the rise of Ryzen on the used market. Yeah, that was an intentional pun. AMD FX CPU bundles are being sold very cheap, meaning that you could get a FX6300 CPU, RAM, and motherboard for around the $200 mark. While this is not the best value compared to the other offerings that I mentioned at the beginning of this video, if you do have some other hardware lying around that you want to part together a PC to flip, this would be the best option. Now, FX series chips can still play some games, especially games like Fortnite. Night. But with some deal hunting, you can actually find bundles that could go under $200, which would make a great option to do a from scratch complete build with one of those budget cases I suggested in my earlier video and only spend about $300 to $350 and probably be able to sell it for like $4 or $450. Now, yes, these are certainly much harder to find and progressively in order of difficulty to obtain, we have the i5-2400 systems being the easiest all the way down to this being the most difficult. It's really something that you could do that's a little bit different and have you stand out in the used market compared to those who are pretty much doing the exact same thing at the exact same level. But overall, those are my recommendations for pre-built systems and, well, other combo deals that can actually help you get on your way to building PCs and being able to flip them for a profit. This idea also works for those who just want to build a budget PC as well. Just because you can make a profit off these doesn't mean you can't use it for your own system as well, so keep that in mind if you're watching this video. If you have any other systems that you recommend yourself, comment them down below. I know a lot of people work with older Xeon hardwares and 
and Xeon workstations, which is something I want to get into at some point. But for the sake of this video, I want to point out systems that I have personally worked with and sold. And Xeons are something I haven't touched yet, but definitely there will be some future content around it. Thanks again, guys, and be sure you're subscribed to stay tuned for the next video. Peace out, guys. Yeah, I'm wearing a corgi dabbing. You know what? Don't judge me. I'll see you.